EPB is providing three crews to help get Florida's power grid up and running again after Hurricane Ian moves through. Dallas Payton tells us what they'll be doing. Crews are set up in Naples, Florida, waiting for Hurricane Ian to pass. Once the storm passes, Florida Power and Light will direct them to affect the areas to get power restored. Hundreds, if not thousands, of electric contractors are on standby waiting for the hurricane to pass. EPB has 14 people of their own on the ground. We got the call over the weekend, uh, so they left, I believe, Sunday and to get down there and stage. That's one benefit of a hurricane in some aspects is they can plan ahead and get the resources they anticipate needing. Um, as far as coming back, it's really going to depend on uh, Florida Power Light, how long they need them. Uh, we've released them and expect them to be gone from anywhere for about a week or two to up to about a month. Grant Carricker with EPB says crews will have minimal rest as they'll be working 16-hour shifts seven days a week to help get power back up. Yeah, typically as they start working, there's a lot of water uh, that's built up from the storm surge and just the sheer amount of rainfall. So between the sandy water and the typical hazards with that, uh, wildlife and then the electrical hazards, it's a potentially pretty dangerous job down there. He says this is a big and powerful storm, meaning there is a lot of work that will have to be done. In this instance, they'll just line them out and they'll start rebuilding whatever they need to, putting lines back up, poles back up, uh, changing out transformers that have been damaged, uh, basically just having to rebuild a lot. When APB was contacted for help, Carriker says they sprung into action. We want to help out as much as possible and that's what a lot of this industry is, is helping others out. We needed the help in uh, 2020 with the tornado there. Uh, so releasing these contract crews, going down there, helping people get their power back on. Um, it's what they it's what they love doing. For local three news, I'm Dallas Payton.